We gotta look to the bottom of the standings. We kind of been roasting Golden Guardians uh, early on here in the show, but the, the main question is, we got two teams without a win left in EU and NA, Unicorns of Love and Golden Guardians. Who is gonna get that elusive first W first? First W first. If we were just going off the skill of the roster and how they're playing, it's like Golden Guardians. That's gotta be Golden Guardians. You know, they have looked weak, but they haven't looked nearly as weak as the Unicorns of Love have, lo have looked in their own region. But when you look at the schedule for these teams, oh my it gosh. is just a nightmare for the Golden Guardians. I don't know where they're ever going to pick up a win in these ones. You know, best of ones, yes, you can do anything to get a win, but my God, these are some tough matches. The next four for the Guardians, TSM, Team Liquid this week, and then you've got Echo Fox, 100 Thieves. That's brutal, man. I, I, don't, I don't care what you think of the Golden Guardians. You really cannot tell me, unless you have drastically different opinions on these other teams, that they're not going to be absolutely stomping the Golden Guardians. I have, you know, there is faith in this team in having some talent and things that they can do and the shot calling of high, of course, but you're watching in these matchups that they have, it's like, well, who's your carry? Because Defley is supposed to be it, but he's not really, contracts. he's not really stepping up. And then it's contracts, but contracts is making a couple of key mental mistakes when you're the carry that you cannot be making. So it's just not working for the Golden Guardians so far. And unfortunately for them, I don't see it changing anytime soon with the matchups that they have. It's hard to carry at uh, three losing lanes as a jungler. That's the old solo queue. Always been the jungler. I'm asking a lot here, yeah. Um, their best chance is probably TSM. Yeah. First game of the week, this split, because I can't see them beating Liquid Echo Fox or 100 Thieves. Jump on TSM while you can. Yeah, this while they're still chance. figuring things out, that's your best chance to take them down. Um, I think unicorns actually have the better chance. Now, are you saying that? Win. Are you saying that because you think they're talented, or because you think they I'm might have purely lucked on in, schedule? Might have lucked into a yeah. better schedule. Listen, they play H2K first game of the day on Friday to start the week I three. Still don't have, I still don't think they beat H2K, but I think that they have a better chance of beating H2K than Golden Guardians against TSM. But it's just like H2K. Oh, I don't want to make that pick. H2K is the best matchup. Unicorns could hope for. It's the best they're going to get for any a long of the time. other nine teams. Uh, and it has to be that way. Because if it's not that, they're scooped. Their next three Vitality, Fnatic, G2, Good Night Unicorns, you're not probably winning any of those. So they got to beat H2K to open up week three. And I think they could as long as Exile stops. Uh, I don't nine. know. I don't know if you're going to see that though, man. Don't play Vladimir. Can't I, get a kill on that champion. I cut this pack to get this, these, these vids here of the unicorns that love playing. And every time I was cutting them, I'm slapping my forehead just going, what are you doing, man? You can't put yourself there. The times where he's got his ear and he's queuing in right into the middle of the team. and He's got no one to follow him up. Just pure disrespect, not working, not playing to the level that you need to be playing at all, even to be playing in the EU LCS, let alone getting wins for your team. The Unicorns of Love need Exile to step it up big time. You know, surprisingly enough, the highest damage percentage for a jungler so far in EU is Cold on Unicorns. Well, he has to. Because he's playing champions like Kane, he's playing Rengar. He's saying, uh, maybe I'll try and carry. Listen, I love Cold. I loved him as trashy yeah. back on Splice. If he's the main carry of your team, you're, you're in trouble. trouble. You're, you're in serious trouble. trouble. It should be Samix. I mean, he was, he put up. MVP caliber numbers. He's only picking up those damage numbers because he's having to camp mid lane while Exile's in the gray screen simulator zone, man. It is a rough life for the Unicorns of Love. Hopefully for them and their fans, they can get it back on the right track soon. H2K is their chance That's their time. to get that first W because after that, it is tough sledding oh, for yeah. Unicorns. Imagine Unicorn sledding. <laughs> it doesn't work well, man. Hooves are tough to on toboggans. Does anyone else know what toboggans are? That's a Canadian thing, right? Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more esports content.